no camera today. I'm not feeling too well. But it is 8.28 on Thursday the 21st. Seem to have caught a cold. Doesn't appear to be the Rona. Here we're at 2.80 and 21 cents as our balance. Where did we leave off? Way up here. And then it just sold off big time. Again. So markets were, I guess, ready to drop. Not sure what the deal is, but we have breached 4,400 and we're now in the 4,390s, which is unfortunate for our long-term investments. Unemployment was down, which, you know, can't have people having jobs now, can we? It's bad for the economy. <laughs> it's bad for, bad for business. Yeah. Anyway, I I keyed 850. Yeah. I think we got to go back down to one contract, which is kind of a bummer, but one contract scalping, a one to one risk ratio. Got a second entry long forming on here. Pull that down below. Can it break through? Oh, one. It hit it and then sold. Okay, that was good. That was pretty good. Hands, hands, push, push. Ugh. I gotta let it play out, which is totally a piece of crap. Man, they know that I was slow. High, what was the high on that? In 50. Yeah, I needed to be two ticks earlier. Can't even get out now with the one point scalp yet. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Do it. Do it. Hey. Nice. We'll take it. Second entry long. And it hit our tar two point scalp target. We will take a look at the tape. 290.21 less our fee. Great. What was that number? 20. Oh, got us right out at two. Right out at two points. Nice, nice move down. They're trying to buy that. What the heck? <laughs> oh my gosh. That's bad for David. Wow, come on now. You got to put it where you got to put it.
Gotta be one tick up. Man, that stinks. That was the second leg. Come on, dump that off. Dump that off. That was strong buying there. Ay caramba. Stay short though. For crying out loud, bros. Oof. They're reversing it. How on earth did that happen? Wait a minute. I'm wrong. I have to sell that. I moved that up. Wait. O two four hundred first second attempt to go long. This actually should be a nice one. I'm gonna move my target up. Not that high. Not that low either. Wait, we need two points out of this. Am I stuck in a range and getting trapped every time? Just got to deal with it. If it's bad choices, bad choices, I got to deal with it. And I got to take my scalps as they come. Oh, you frat bastard. Damn it. Come on, go for it, baby. Push through. Push through. 10, 20. Minus 1, 2, 3. Yeah. That's potentials. 
the trap, people. Oh my god. Now I'm trapped. You absolute goof. I can't believe this. Every time I try to go short in the downtrend, I get trapped. I'm sorry, but that's just wrong. Gosh, man, this is really a challenge to make it. Gosh, darn it. Okay, we're pulling off the EMA, I think. Let's take our 91 risk here. Break a new extreme. You know, I'm going to probably scalp out of this thing if I can. That's <sighs> how I do it. Still have a minute on this candle. Dang it. It's, it's buying. It's buying. Why are you buying? That was matching. Dog. I thought that broke down through there. 95 even. 95 even. <laughs> I'm out. Too much resistance there it makes me nervous. I can't afford to lose on that trade. Glad I got out when I did, quite frankly. Or not. <laughs> Holy cow. They just clobbered it.
Yeah. We're almost an hour into our trading today and we're up about 10 bucks, which is great. Which is great. This is part of the rebuilding and I'm definitely not feeling at my best, but I'm definitely trying to do the right thing here and take my losses whether I like it or not. Mostly I don't like it. <laughs> and again, I'm sorry for... I did have a bit of a cold, and I don't think I have the Rona. I tested myself, and it was negative on the antigen test. So, yeah. Three minutes on this hourly candle. It may close near its bottom. Hey there, randos. I'm going to be done trading for the day. I took a last trade that was impulsive and I sold at 94 and it went against me pretty heavily up into this range here like you know $25 like five points against me and then I saw it showing weakness and I bought one more contract or sold one more contract at 95.50 and got out at 94 even, thus break even plus the profit on the second contract. And you can see I got out at 10 o'clock at that 94 mark. And if we look here, it's pretty much near the bottom. Hey, that's my lucky trade of the day, my rabbit's foot trade. I violated my principle that I had been doing, so... I got out, and um, yeah, I don't feel very particularly good about it, even if it does um, end up going where I expected it to. It wasn't uh, what I need to be doing. So here is, uh, I forgot to show the tail of the tape. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight contracts. So $25 minus 8 times 1.2, and we're up $15 today. We'll be at uh, 295 60 thereabouts. So we start the march. We're up over 5% today. That's all we can do every day. Try to reach our 5% goal, which I think is um, ambitious, but doable. And so, yeah, let's look at our account performance. You could see the tail of the tape, a lot of ups and downs. Five wins, two losers. Yeah. We had to pinch out a one a little early. So we're still a little upside down on our risk to reward, reward ratio. But yeah. Let's hope to uh, improve each day. So, all right, on that note, look at that. It's just buying right out. All right. Yeah, we would have been holding on again. So that's why you got to get out. When you're wrong, you're wrong. And definitely I was wrong. So on that note, Random Dave is closing the application. And he'll be back tomorrow. So I'm out of here, gang. Thanks for watching.